We're here to meet Troy. He's going to be building the stone walls for our project house. Good morning. Hey, Roger. Morning. How you doing? Good. I'm impressed. When I build a stone wall on site, I have stuff everywhere. It looks like you have a really efficient operation. For a job like yours, which would probably take you two to three weeks at least on site, we're going to be able to come in and install it that morning. And that's going to save some time and money. Show me around. All right, let's go. So we've got some beautiful bulk field stone and other quarried products here, always on, uh, on site, ready to go. We've got Vermont Chesterfield. We've got a nice Moose Creek, which is a little more tan. You see the Rockport granite. We've got New England flat. We've got your Goshen stone. And what your client picked was the New England round field stone. What some people don't understand is this was a freestanding stone wall. Yeah, we use completely natural bulk field stone from old farm sites, um, new developments. They save all the old walls. Really nice looking stuff. Now, how about our walls? Are they built? Let's go check it out. Well, Roger, this is your wall. And this, uh, this is actually the back of it. Well, how do you build it differently than I do? All of our walls are built with molds and forms. It's a patent process, so I can't tell you all the details. But the masons, they come in, they set your stones face down. We set a grid of number five rebar, and we pour a 4,000 PSI concrete, which you're seeing here. You can see here the nice natural stone top of the wall. And this is the geo grid, which will be pulled out at time of install. How much does each section weigh? These are each about 6,000 pounds. That's why we've got a custom lifting frame that we developed that lifts the walls from the back. Nothing ever touches the stone face or top. Well, here's your wall, Roger. Look at this. It still has all its moss and patina left. It's a really nice looking section of wall. I can't wait to see it on site. Roger. Stonewall Day, and normally you are back here with an army of guys and a mountain of boulders, and here you are raking all by yourself. I'd take every inch of this site if I was building these walls myself. But they're going to come in, and within an hour, we're going to have a whole wall set in place. I cannot wait to see this process. Neither can I. So in terms of prep, what did you do, and did you do anything different than if you were building this uh, in place? No, the same as if we were building it in place. We dug down two feet, we put in three quarter inch stone, and we really compacted it. That's going to give us good granage, and this wall's not going to move. Let's do it. Let's get the other six in. got left to do? Not much. The walls are in. All that's left is uh, a few pockets that we leave open. And you can see here in this entire stone wall that we've brought, we only need two or three of these to get rid of the joints. Oh, you're going to push it right up in here. We, uh, we stay the stones for each wall. Huh. It's designed for that little hole there. Homeowners will perfectly, never know. Yeah, seamless application. Yeah, yeah I, I'll be honest with you. While this thing was going in, we had a bunch of trades come up and they were thankful that Roger wasn't here for two weeks. At least with piles of boulders buggering the whole site. I, I mean, this is amazing. We keep it nice and clean. Yeah. Well, I think the homeowners are going to love it, man. Thank you very much. Really appreciate it. This was fun. Thanks for watching. 
This old house has got a video for just about every home improvement project, so be sure to check out the others. And if you like what you see, click on the subscribe button to make sure that you get our newest videos right in your feed.